whole story last night. So, Kevin, his parents are divorced, and his mom is in France with his older brother. And so, you know, no parents home. Kevin decides he's going to have a party. Okay, good idea, Kevin. Mm -hmm. But then he's like, okay, everybody come over at like 10, 10, 30. Or no, 9, 9, 30, 9, 9, 30. And uh, then his dad calls at like 7. He's like, hey, Kevin, I got some stuff to do tomorrow. I'm going to bring your little brother back tonight at 10 or 10, 30. And Kevin goes, oh, shit. Don't do that. Uh, so he had to have us come over and pretend to have a Smash tournament at his house. <laughs> so I had to bring GameCube controllers. And then they rolled up and the dad's like, it's a lot of people for a Smash tournament. <laughs> like, oh, we all just love Smash. He's like, should I go in and say hi? And thank God Jason was like, nah, 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 you're, you're good, Dad. <laughs> Because Jason totally, we didn't tell him, but he totally knew what was going on. He came about and he's like, like you know what, Jason? There's a, there's no Smash going on right now. Smash tournament. He's like, oh, okay. So, um, uh, for some reason, Dave drank a lot. Like, way too much. Like, like before even Jason was there, he was like four shots deep or five shots deep. Damn. It was, it was... It's interesting. We just let him do it. We just let him keep going. So, um, at some point, he was drinking with this girl, and at some point, <laughs> they've had a way too much to drink, and they're in the bathroom, right? Uh-oh. So, <laughs> so, we're trying to be supportive, fr or half-supportive friends here, right? So, they're in the bathroom, and we're taking bets on whether they're getting it on or not. I forgot that part. <laughs> there was, like, $45 on them doing it oh, man. but then then the zero told the one who dave was with about the bet so the bet was turned off unless oh. we won the bet then the bet was still on so it was a win-win for us <laughs> so, so so i had to so i had to go and be in worcester the next morning so i i wasn't like doing anything that much so i had to leave and i was like oh if dave's like really out of it i'll just drive him home so i go in there and like people like bring them water and stuff i'm like dave you good He's like, oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm good. He's like not even looking at me. I'm like, all right, he's not good. So, like, okay, people like, are getting him like bread and water because you know, that's what you do when you're not not yeah. all there. So we're getting him bread and water, and then I, I hung out for like another hour. And then I go back over there. He's still in the goddamn bathroom. <laughs> so I go up wait, there. Wait, is, no, is the girl still there or is it just him? Oh, no, is he still in there with the girl and the, and the zero, the girl's wait, friend? So he's like, what's going on? Is, is they're, it just, just... they're just like passing out. They're just stupid. Oh, There's nothing is... happening. They're just like chilling in there. Oh, okay. And um, so I go in there. I'm like, okay, I gotta make sure Dave's all right. I'm sure he's had that bread in the water. And I go in there, and Dave and his friend <laughs> are like just like pretty much sleeping at that point. They're not sleeping, but they're like they're not doing anything. They're just like <laughs> drunk. So I go in there, and the zero, the fat girl, she's sitting there just eating all the fucking bread. <laughs> I'm like, Kaylin, what the fuck are you doing? Why are you eating their bread? She's like, oh. I'm like, God damn, what are you doing? She's just sitting there. She's literally just like shoving the entire piece of bread in her mouth. Like, what is going on in here? It's not for you. <laughs> yeah, so then, then they finally get out of the bathroom. And I like go in there to like see what hat, like what, what was up. So I look in the bathroom and there's three half drunk water glasses in the bathroom. Two half-eaten peanut butter and jellies and a potato. <laughs> <laughs> no joke. Because while we were like, you know, we were giving them water and bread, then uh, me and my friend Dan decided we would give them a potato too and see if Dave would eat it. <laughs> and we're like, Dave, he's like, Dave, take his potato. And Dave's like, I don't want a potato. <laughs> he's like, no, 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 take the potato. So he just threw the potato at him and then got the whole bag. He's like, hey, Dave, take the whole bag of potatoes. <laughs> Like, no, I don't want the potato. That sounds like a crazy Smash tournament. It was the we got, it was a great Smash tournament. We all played great. <laughs> it's more like a Smash tournament. Oh yeah. <laughs> with, uh, with fifteen girls there, it was crazy. Also, there was a kid there that like nobody really nobody really likes him. I don't know how to, he's like. So I was on the soccer team in my high school. And he got cut, which is like really hard to do because everybody blew. Mm. 
Uh, but he got cut, but he's like, I don't want to be cut. So somehow he was like the team manager, like, you know, like the loser that gets cut, but uh-huh. still wants to be on the team. So he, he's one of those. And then like, as the season, <laughs> we ordered these warm ups for like, uh, like before the game and stuff. And then there's really this nice, like kind of like a fleece, not fleece. I don't know how to describe it. Like a light, you know, like windbreakers. Windbreakers. Do you know what I'm talking about? They're like the, those jackets that like kind of go like, if you like rub your arm up against it. Oh, yep. Okay, it's kind of like that kind of a look, but they're like a, it's more like a workout material. So that and like matching sweatpants. So my coach like accidentally got too many of them. So he was like, oh, I don't know what to do with these. They said Shepherd Hill on them. I guess I'll give one to Ross. And now Ross, I don't think he's ever taken the goddamn thing off. He hasn't touched a <laughs> soccer ball for the goddamn team, but he's never taken off his stupid warm up. So he was wearing that. Like, all right, you're two years removed from this, Ross. You got to get a life now. <laughs> and uh, he was there with his ex girlfriend, but he already has another girlfriend. Oh. So we couldn't, like, we couldn't figure that one out. And she just like followed him around the whole night and like looked super pissed off. <laughs> but like, but now his new girlfriend totally knows because Dan like Snapchatted her older sister or something like that. So like, it's a small town. I don't know what you expect if you go to a party <laughs> with your ex girlfriend. And someone's not going to know. So that wasn't that smart. <clears throat> trying to think what else happened. At some point, I ended up by myself downstairs eating a peanut butter and jelly and playing WWE vs. Raw vs. SmackDown 2007 by myself. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I was hanging out with like four people. And the cam was playing, and I was just sitting there with my drink and my food. And I'm sitting there, just like, ah, I just want to sit down and enjoy my sandwich. And then I look up, and then everyone's gone, and I'm playing by myself. <laughs> Cam's like, quick, RKO this guy. And I'm like, what? And then he just runs away. Nice. Are you playing something? What's up? I'll do anything, yeah. anything at all. I can do anything for a if I want to. Josh, I'll do anything for love. I'll do anything. Hashtag love wins. For meth. You're welcome. Yeah, would you ever try meth? Because you, you say it so much, it's kind of like you have to try it. <laughs> I don't know if meth would be really a Theo's jam. Yeah, what, what would your drug of choice be, Theo? Alright, Grodd. Just probably pick marijuana because it's the it's the weakest one. Not if you get like chemical marijuana. It's probably still not as bad as the other ones. No, it's addictive. Oh, okay. Laced with cocaine. Yeah. Unless you get marijuana laced with LSD. No, I per- actually heard about that kind of stuff. Not not that. Like chemical marijuana. Marijuana. Apparently, they're making meat in like laboratories now. Yeah, whatever. I'd love to eat some lab meat, and not like a laboratory, like a labradoodle. Labradoodle snapper cat. Oh yeah, Josh. You know, uh, Gr Smash, Smash that channel. Yep. You know how the, the picture, the profile picture is James Franco? Yes. Dave thought that that was Scar. What? <laughs> you know Scar, like the commentator? Yeah, I know. <laughs> he was like, we're watching the we're watching the Grand Finals today, and they, show, they like, showed the commentators with Scar and Tove. He's like, oh, that's the guy, it's GR Smash, right? I'm like, <laughs> no, Dave. <laughs> Just because it's a middle-aged white man doesn't mean it's, it's Scar. I thought for a minute that GR Smash was Green Ranger. I read that somewhere, but I don't think it is. Yeah.
My knife kind of looks like it's made out of styrofoam. <laughs> but you know what? That's okay. I like styrofoam. You don't like styrofoam? I thought Groton was going to cure himself earlier that we had a, a jungler who was higher ranked than all of us playing with us. Is he higher ranked than us? He was platinum five. five. Couldn't tell. He's, pl he's <laughs> <laughs> played better than all of us. Especially that first game. I, I, it is very rare that I... I don't think I've ever had a jungler have more money than me. That's rare. Plays a mean scion. Does he only play jungle scion? Which is kind of odd to me. I had to figure he's a top lane player. It's not. But nope. That doesn't mean, doesn't mean much to me. I see two quirky games in his match history. Three quirky games. Four quirky games. Oh wow, the match history is big now. Never mind. That was like. Uh, one, two, three, four. He has one, two, three of them, 80, four of them, AP. Yeah, four AP, three AD. So that means when he goes AD carry, Theo, he builds him AD. You know, the, the attack damage carry. Guys, I'm an Ergot Master. It's kind of sad. I'm not really proud of that. <laughs> yeah. I'm Bar. almost a Bar. master. I think I'm one of the best Urgots around. I think I could be an Urgot 1v1. Doesn't mean you're a better Urgot than me. Oh, yeah, how do I prove this? I don't know. Play Urgot. All Win right. games. I, uh, accept. Uh. Go for it. Uh, I'm not playing her god. <laughs> as far Wait. as AD carries go, team fight wise, he's really easy. Lane wise, uh, it's a little harder. Uh, I'm trying to think. Pre tier, it's horrible. You just die to everything. You can never fight. You shoot one Q and you're out of man. It's like Blitzcrank 80 Gary. Once you get tier, you still can't fight because you fucking built tier and they build all AD. Jesus Christ. What was that? I heard that. And for some reason, it doesn't go through my headset. It goes through my computer. You go let Theo play because he's already ranked, you know? No. Nope. That mean you won't play a video game. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I, I'm busy right now. Unless you're not playing that game. <laughs> you can play Dota. Unless, well, you're not playing the feet shooting game. <laughs> we can play uh, Dota. I'll play Dota. I have it installed already, of course. Call Pudge. Dibs on Pudge. Dibs on, uh, Sniper. Should I install Dota? Yes. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> no, I don't want to ruin my 100% win rate, <laughs> you guys. I'm gonna do it. Should I do it or not? I'm I'm playing with or without you. Wow. What other games do we- I, If you didn't tell me to buy any games during the Steam sales, I have no games. You should worry. We gotta listen to Groton next time. Groton told me to buy Divinity and yelled at me when I wouldn't. That's the only game he told me to buy. Or that... What was that game you showed us, Theo? You remember what I'm talking about? It was one of those, like, rogue games. <laughs> Rogue-like, I don't know. That's just, like, a genre. Right? Like a top down, like 2D pixel RPG kind of thing. 
Yo, you're useless, man. No, he's just... Hammer watch? I don't think I looked at a hammer watch. Never seen this in my life. I am now playing a Dota 2 bot match. No. It was some horrible game that was like a dollar. No. That was you. I'll find it. You're useless. There's a button that just locks in a random hero. <laughs> oh yeah, you know what? The Kurt's roommates, they like only do that. 